What up, y'all? This is poor Nick, 2156, trying to fix this so that y'all can see me. Alright, I don't know how much of the bottle y'all can see. There we go. Uh, today, I went, found this in my pocket just a few minutes ago. Uh, I haven't tried these. I've been seeing them a lot more lately. Wanted to give them a shot. It looks kind of like a, you know, nicotine, what they're called is nicotine pouches, three milligram, uh, ZYN, uh, three milligram, this is the winter green. Uh, trying to figure out now how to open this, if anybody knows how to open these dang things. Uh, It'd be appreciative. <laughs> uh, okay, so you... <laughs> they really don't make it good. Okay, so it's just like a regular can. I'm guessing. <laughs> Where you have to crack the lid. Okay. <laughs> That's very, very weird. So what it looks like is you got to push in on the sides. That right here. Like when the lid's on, you got to line up the arrows. And then push in. Man, I don't have the strength like I used to. So I'll just pop it open. Alright. So that's new. This is the ZYN, 3 milligram, nicotine pouches. Uh, let me see how many we got here real quick. For one container, you get, let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Basically a normal can of pouches. So, 15. These pouches are 3 milligrams each. They kind of look like snooze pouches. The way that the stuff inside of it is. Uh, it has no wintergreen smell, but this is the wintergreen tobacco-free nicotine pouches 3 milligrams. And as y'all know me, I uh, did Longhorn, Grizzly, and Copenhagen. So this is my very first time ever trying this dip. So I hope y'all like this video. I'll tell you what the flavor is once it's in. Let's start off with one pouch, since it is three milligrams. I don't know whether you're supposed to upper lip and enjoy for up to 60 minutes is what it says on the can. Let me show you the can while this is working. Ooh, that burn. Alright. Let me line these up just in case. Alright. So this can... Oh, so this is nicotine salt derived from tobacco along with other food grade ingredients, flavor, pH, adjuster, stabilizer, filter, and sweetener. So this is ZYN, uh, like a nicotine salt, uh, which is very unique. It's a three milligram, which is three milligrams of nicotine. Probably a li little bit, or a lot stronger than Longhorn, which I did pick up a couple cans of that, like y'all know me. 
This is the wintergreen flavor. I do like the container that's in. The only thing I wish for these pouches is that it had a capper, like most of the pouches do. Uh, let me see if I can't find one of the cans real quick for you. So I'm guessing this is like snooze. Uh, there isn't really any strong flavor to this. This is the ZYM. This is a wolf pouch. The difference is between ZYN and wolf, <laughs> ZYN is a thinner pouch or a thinner, you know, can. Does not have a cap on it. By cap, I mean where you can store your uh, used dip instead of just spitting it out on the or pouches so hence I, I haven't dipped Timberwolf in almost five years now uh, this one there really isn't any flavor I wish it did have flavor I'm getting a buzz from just one pouch, so three milligrams might be a little too much for me. It's not salivating enough for me. I do like a dip that makes you salivate where you do have to spit. Uh, I've done general snooze and skull snooze, or camel snooze. I love those. Uh, people say that camel snooze is garbage. I like it. General Snooze is really good too. Uh, a little bit stronger than Camel, but this almost has the same flavor as like a cotton candy, almost. Get the sweetness of cotton candy. Uh, I don't taste the wintergreen, which, as y'all know me, I go for a Longhorn as my daily dip. Uh, I try something new every, try to do every video. This was one that I had in my jacket. I think I was planning on doing a video on it. Never got around to it. Uh, let me read what it says on the back. Uh, keep out of reach, reach of children. One nicotine pouch contains three milligrams of nicotine. Pouch and content are not intended to be consumed. Duh. Discard after use. Duh. Another duh moment. Uh, looks like sell only allowed in the U.S. Uh, let me look. Net weight about 0 0.21 ounce or 6 grams. Sorry if the lid's upside down. Eek trying to read the back while well, I showcase uh, it's a Swedish match in a LLC Richmond Virginia so this is made in Richmond Virginia this product contains nicotine nicotine is an additive chemical uh, yeah so it's a it also is nicotine salt which I don't know if y'all are vapors on my channel or not. Nicotine salt can be a vapor too. Which I think is kind of funny how they put it in pouches. I mean, the only downside, it's the same amount of pouches as one of the bigger cans. But it doesn't have one of those cappers where you can store your pouches. So you basically have to take it out, throw it in a garbage. So, my phone's about to go, so... This is Foreign Neck with a new product review. The flavor and the how white it is, it's not a lasting flavor. So thank you. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.